Hello everyone. We hope this finds you well, in good spirit, and having a good day. In a last ditch effort to get a letter into the hands of President Donald Trump before World War III, the prophesied battle of Armageddon, we would like to read this letter on behalf of the prophet Elijah in an effort to prevent the prophesied battle of Armageddon. Unfortunately, this battle has been prophesied and will take place, but we want to make sure that it doesn't happen on Donald Trump's watch. Without further ado, this letter was originally written in February 18th, 2017. Several attempts were made to try to get this letter into his hands, and we believe unsuccessfully. If anyone in YouTube world knows how to get this letter into the hands of President Donald J. Trump, Please do so for the well-being of the world. Dear Mr. Trump, we hope this finds you well, well rested, in good spirit, and having a good day. It is with great respect and humility that this appeal is written to you. We have been pleasantly refreshed with the diligent steps you have already taken in regards to your campaign promises of making America great again. In this era of nothing but lies and deceit from previous presidential administrations, it is truly miraculous that you are the President of the United States and are actually walking your talk. We would like to commend you on your walking in faith of our Father who art in heaven and his eldest son, Prince Michael, Jesus the Christ, in his last incarnation. Please know that you are blessed and protected as long as you keep the faith and don't deviate from the truth, and you uphold God's laws for planet Earth. Father knows what is in your heart and whether it is pure or not. In an effort to keep this message brief, we will get to the point. We are reaching out to you as a representative of the true tribes of Israel, not the Zionist counterfeit state of Israel in the Middle East. The reason for this letter is to respectfully request your company for a brief period of time for a critically important spiritual message from God. This message must be delivered in person. We understand that you have a spiritual guide in Paula White. We are concerned that an attempt to meet with you through her may meet with failure. So we are doing what you would do, go to the source for a face-to-face -face meeting. We understand that you are not like, quote, most presidents and welcome good counsel. We believe that you understand that we live in the last generation of humanity from a biblical perspective. We also believe that you understand the magnitude of what mutually assured destruction means. One of the most important reasons you were elected president was to prevent World War III, nuclear holocaust. Although Armageddon is prophesied to happen, we want to make sure that it doesn't happen on your watch. As you are aware, only Father, the Great I Am, controls what happens here on Earth. We believe he is giving us a reprieve from the tremendous sins that the American people have allowed to occur under previous administrations, as long as we correct them. You are the nation's last hope for redemption. All things are possible through God, especially the prevention of the impending world war that is planned by the Satanists who rule this planet by covert means. You are in need of accurate biblical spiritual guidance at this crucial time in human history. Paula White is a beautiful soul whose heart appears to be in the right place. She has shortcomings, as we all do, that may lead to misdirection for you, the most powerful person on earth in the public's eye. A recent visit to her church, which is more like a concert or a rave on Super Bowl Sunday, quote unquote, was totally unbiblical. This concerned us greatly. As was prophesied in the Old Testament, Malachi chapter 4 verse 5, Behold, I will send you Elijah the prophet before the coming of the great and dreadful day of the I Am. Surah 43.61 The prophet is here. His body was born the same year as the Zionist state of Israel was created, exactly as Jesus had prophesied. His body is one of the prophesied bloodline lineage. He is the biblical expert who knows better than anyone on this planet what the scriptures predict will occur in the future as well as what prophecies have already passed, 99.9% .9 of them in exact and minute detail, including his body's birth. 
This is vital information that needs to be relayed to you. Due to the magnitude of this topic, this message must be delivered by him in person. We pray that you heed our humble request. It is hoped that this brief meeting will take root and grow into a lasting relationship of counsel and friendship to help you succeed in making America, Great Britain, and the world great again through our Father who art in heaven. Any other way will result in failure in the unfolding of the prophesied battle of Armageddon. We pray that you take this message seriously and heed our request. We are of modest means, living according to Father's will. We would need your assistance to meet with you wherever is most convenient for you. The prophet is currently overseas in your beloved Scotland with no means to meet with you. You may be amazed to be told by him that the Scottish people, like your dear late mother and thus yourself, are descendants from Zara, one of the twin sons of Judah, the son of Jacob Israel, Genesis 38:28. And it came to pass when she travailed that the one put out his hand, and the midwife took and bound upon his hand a scarlet thread, saying, This came out first, and it came to pass, as he drew back his hand, that behold, his brother came out, and she said, How hast thou broken forth? Why hast thou made this breach against thee? Therefore his name was called Pharez, breach. And afterward came out his brother, that had the scarlet thread upon his hand, and his name was called Zara thus making you a true Israelite from the tribe of Judah Zara. This is why the Scottish flag has the scarlet red Lion of Judah Zara on it, and 14 Scottish clan chiefs have the scarlet red hand of Judah Zara on their coat of arms. Understanding the security that protects your position, it is humbly requested that you facilitate whatever travel arrangements and protocols that are necessary to make this meeting with him happen, either in the United States, at the White House, or Mar Largo, or Turnberry in Scotland, preferable where we are. We thank you for your time and pray for your consideration. We look forward to hearing from you with good news. Peace be upon you, and more importantly, within you and your house. God bless you, and God bless America. Please contact the Prophet Elijah at ja at jahtruth.net. That's J-A-H at J-A-H truth.net. If anyone has the ability to get this message in front of President Donald J. Trump in hopes that he makes the correct decision and meets with the Prophet Elijah, may God bless you. And may God bless anyone who is willing to fight for God's law here on planet Earth. Anything else will result in the fire of Armageddon. For this we pray in Jesus' holy name. Amen.